Hello there, guys. Thank you so much for waiting. It's time for the horse girl part of the stream title. <laughs> Zuma Musume Pretty Darby. Third anniversary event. Let's go. I hope you guys are looking forward to this. We are going to be playing a run with the girl I wanted to get when her banner was live and didn't get. But then I got her free with a free ticket during this third anniversary event, which is always a good thing. So first things first, let's uh, support the people in my circle. For anyone curious, I have completed the battle pass. So I may very well, when I can afford to, buy the premium pass so I can get all of those rewards. I mean, it is a pretty nice little way of earning extra, extra things. I mean, you'll earn like 500 gems for free through the battle pass. But you also get, if you pay for it, you'll get triple. Which is a temple, which, you know, it's definitely worth it because the price of the pass is less than buying 1500 gems outright. So, you know, that's a pretty interesting way of going about it. So, from what I understand... Oh, apology from management? Huh. Interesting. I wonder why they felt the need to do that. Unfortunately, a game like Uma Musume, I can't toggle my uh, expressions and stuff. Which is partially why I wish I had a stream deck of some sort. <laughs> and I do have a throne with that sort of stuff on there. Not that I expect to get anything from that, but you know. It is how it is, you know? Um, but yeah, who wants story time first? I don't think I have all of Shevel Grand's, um, story events. I most definitely don't, more than likely. <laughs> if I go through these. I got six out of seven. <gasps> we'll do story time after the run, I think. Because there is a chance I might be able to unlock that final one. So yeah, the new scenario, the ult Ultimate Athletics Festival, I think, or the Ultra Athletics Festival. So let me see, where are you? You're in the long range. If I do unlock her final um story thing... She's literally my new top five Uma Musume, Shevel Grand. And when we go through the story that I have for her, I think you'll all understand why. I have two patches on this game to translate. So... I feel like we need some stamina -na -na -na. Being a long distance Uma, stamina is kind of important for her. I know I have one who has max stamina. Somewhere, I know she's here. One of my Kita San Blacks is potential there. And I think it's a regular one. There she is. There you go. 63 stamina. We'll go with this. One thing I've learned is 
The scenario links help. You know, I've learned something from this, from putting scenario links. Sometimes you get like little events where the uh, the uh, some of the stats will go up when you interact with them. The scenario link I've learned gives you a chance to double that if you trigger that event with them. So yeah, if you're ever doing a run, try and put as many scenario link characters in there as possible. You'll get some good rewards from it. If you can trigger enough of them. So here's her inheritance. Let's see what we can do. I think my best with her so far is UF5. Because this event is more tailored to medium and mild Uma Musume. And as you saw when we were picking her, Chevel Grand is a long range Uma. Which is where we have to hopefully get her decent stamina. Ooh. Now that's a good start right off the bat. But do I want it to be all yellow or all blue? I'll go with all yellow. Let's see what it gives us. Alright, we'll go with this one. There you go. I like getting that early. Getting that early is definitely going to help in the long run. You want to try and get... Whenever you get the advice, you want it to be all one type. Because that gives you the best results. So we did yellow before, so now we'll do blue instead. Oh, 19 intelligence, but I think I'll go with the speed. The speed is good. I'll go with speed. Whoa, and we can do the red one too. There you go. That's a great start. It's kind of interesting to see. <laughs> How, how the game will let you start. Alright, we'll get the energy back. Ooh. Right, that could have been the one that gave me plus 30 energy. Could have been good. But we didn't, we didn't choose it, so unfortunately it's not gonna be great. Um... You have to be mindful. If you want the best possible run on this, you need to make sure you actually get a perfect score on every every meet meetup for this event. Otherwise, you will not get the maximum benefit at the end of it. If you get 15 wins in every one, you will get plus 55. That is insane. Plus 55 in the long run is just quite the buff to get. And we have our events with the trainer. That's it. More stamina, please. Mm. We'll go with the wisdom. Oh man, we're getting lucky with the energy. <sighs> yes, 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 yes. Gimme, gimme, gimme. 
Damn, it could have been another really good one, but yeah, I'll take the 41 speed. I'll take the 41 speed. Her wisdom is a little low, so we'll sacrifice the 20 energy to get 10 energy and 10 wisdom. Oh. Oh, and then you throw everyone on wisdom training. I dig it. I dig it a lot. Thank you. Right, we had a lot already. Leader medium? Wait, wait a second. Wait, she's medium? No kidding. One of her signature skills gives her a medium specialty. Even though she's in the long distance. That is weird, but okay, sure, why not? Okay. <laughs> Everyone's favorite. She's most certainly mine. Alright. Ah. Energy drink downed. Let's hope it doesn't keep me awake too late. As you can see, the patch ain't perfect. Not everything is translated. Yeah, we're ready. Stato! Frilled Lemon! <laughs> of course Frilled Lemon would be at the front. Sand Commando! <laughs> Lady Adamant! <laughs> you gotta love some of these names for horses. My stream on Friday might be a little different to what I've scheduled. When the Nintendo Partner Direct dropped, a load of demos dropped with it. I was initially going to play a load of demos on that day, but I didn't really feel it. I didn't really feel up to it that day. So I'm probably going to end up like doing that on Friday instead of um, Ace Attorney. It's another reason for me to use the wheel. Look who's at the front of the pack! It's my little- it's my best- it's my third best girl, Shevel Grand! Don't think anyone's catching her from here, I'm afraid. I have to remember after the stream, I need to commission these new animated emotes for the subathon. Tetra Bibelos? <laughs> you did it, Shevel. Great job, girl. Send Commando. Frilled Apple. And frilled lemon. An apple and a lemon. <laughs> Very good. Very good. To save us a bit of time for the uh, story at the end, I'm actually going to skip anything that's below a G2. Well, anything below a G1. Of course, one of Shevel Grand's uh, requirements is to get um, three free wins. 
Oh. Oh, that's a shame. That's a shame. That could have been so good if it gave us like a perfect, a chance for a perfect sequen sequenter. I honestly don't know why I said that. I just made that one up. Right, um... I think we have to change it red. Or maybe I won't. Maybe I'll go for the... I'll try and optimize my stat growth. We've mastered everything for the blue sphere. We need to get the red sphere up. Hmm. Damn. I was hoping for some additional... No, we'll change the blue to red. We've got to try and make sure we can win every event. <laughs> Even if it means sacrificing some of the stat growth we could get. If you can optimize your run perfectly. You should be able to... Do a UE girl at the worst. Getting all your, uh, partner Umas to rainbow is also a very useful way of getting that. Really. Really. We need to rest. I'm sorry. We needed to rest. Oh, there we go. We got it. We got... We got pity. We got pity. Everyone's on the speed training. We kind of have to. We kind of have to. Alright, come on. I think I should have picked the top one. Top one would have given us, like, a big buff. Aw, oh, cool. We've achieved our goal. We've achieved it. Probably go with that one just because the hammer throw is so low. We'll take the wisdom as well because that was a lot of Umas I needed to raise my friendship with on that one. Let's get our wisdom up as well. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right, okay. We have to do a race. We have to do a race. And it was only a G3. No need to waste any time watching those races. <coughs> Excuse me. DIY challenge. Yes. Oh, those are high fail rates, unfortunately. I ain't gonna risk it. Sometimes you have to push your luck. But I don't think we're doing too bad at the moment, so I'm not willing to do... I'm not willing to take that risk. Sixteen, twenty. I guess we go for the twenty.
<laughs> You've got to be careful. You've got to hit that target before before the UAF. The UAF is another way to get more fans. And as you can see, we got enough. We got enough to do this. Fifteen wins. There you go. That's the perfect start. Yeah, basically every event, every uh, every uh, every Uma Musume Athletic Festival, you have to increase your minimum stats by ten levels to get the medal. To you know, to avoid getting medals, because you just want the wins. That's all you care about. More stamina, please. <laughs> So as you can see, we got most of it already. And perfect training right from the get-go. Although it's only plus four for that one. Mm. You know what? I think intelligence is the better option. During regular, like... During the other events, Wisdom is probably the, uh, the least beneficial. Alright, give me that. Give me it. <laughs> give it to me! Mmm... Hold on. Right, I guess we go for the yellow. We need the yellow. And it's wisdom again that's the best... The best stat increase of them all. That's it. Give me... Share your energy with me! Alright, we've maxed everything. So, we'll make it all yellow. Yellow seems to be the biggest stat gains of them all. Oh, it's again! It's again wisdom! Crazy! Hey there, Hasberry! Hello, friend, welcome! How are you? Welcome! I hope you're having a wonderful day. Right. Alright. She's doing good. She's doing pretty good. I'm quite satisfied with how she's performing. Oh! Oh yeah, baby! Oh baby! Let's go! Oh, god damn it. <laughs> of course a bot would come into my server, of course. I only get bots in my server anymore. I hope that it, that has been dealt with, at least. <laughs> I'm so sad that only seeing bots seem to join my server nowadays. It sucks. Uh, let's see here, um... We do that one, just so we can get Major Orion to her friendship maximum potential. That's what I was looking at. 
Good practice. Nice. Mm. All right, we'll rest again. We need we need to keep her rested. I mean, unfortunately, Hazzy has been bothered by them, and that that makes me feel bad. I don't I don't want my I don't want my community to make people uncomfortable, even if they're not technically in my community. <laughs> Oh, boy. They're all there. But the buffs on here are just too good to ignore. Damn, she got energy back. Let's go with Guts. Are you sure it's not a bot? Because some bots can be very convincing. <laughs> I mean, when I first joined the VTuber community, I did fall for a number of bots. They seemed like... They, they generally tricked me into thinking they were actually people. Alright, another perfect Yuma Musume Athletics Festival. 15 wins. We're aiming for the top prize. <gasps> yellow and blue. Alright, yellow. Or blue. Yellow or blue? Blue. <laughs> we need more blue. Whoa. Give me that speed buff. All right, now we can have yellow. <laughs> now we can have yellow. And it seems to be the strength stat. Yeah. Optimize your speech episodes. That's the best advice to get good stats. Who? <sighs> 66, 52. We go for the 66. Let's muscle it! More guts. 45. This has been a very satisfactory first speech episode. Let's hope that more is to come. Oh my goodness. I've got to do two more races though. That's the only problem I have now. I need to do two more races. Even though the stats are going good for me, I need to make sure. I need to make sure that I'm getting... Oh. We just need fight. Ah oh, no. We're doing a race. We can't ignore the races anymore. We have to get two in. We gotta squeeze two races in. Nice. Ah oh, no. Oh, the... It's so perfect as well. Some of this training is perfect. Ooh. 
Alright. We have time. We can still get this. See, there you go. We gotta make him red. Oh, just barely enough. It's gonna just barely be enough. All right, now we have to do... All right, this is a good one. This is a good run. The Japan Cup. It's always a reliable source of fans. But we just need to win. <sighs> so the plan is to commission six new animated emotes. That is the plan. I'm hopefully going to get them in time for the subathon. I need I need more incentives for people to want to sub, you know? Alright, Shevel. You ready to show them what a winner looks like? You may not think you're a winner, but I believe in your capabilities. Just because your sisters are considered more talented than you are, doesn't mean you can't at least get close to them. I will make sure you do. Yeah, as the digital age also gets bigger and bigger, and more and more scams and stuff are basically being used to take money from people. It is definitely useful to be internet savvy at this point in time. And if you aren't, make sure there's someone you know who is, so they can help you. I mean, this is partially why people don't want to, you know, use their, uh, their online banking, after all. <laughs> I mean, they'll find a way. I lost $10 falling for a uh, fake game. They got me. I mean, it ha it happens, though. It happens. I mean, Shovel Grand is great. Yeah, if they get access to your PayPal and you have trusted payments on, like, Discord or something, do not... Do not do that, okay? Because if it's a trusted payment, then PayPal will not re help you. That's what I learned. It's the only money they got from me, though. And it was only, like, $10 for, like, one gift subscription to Discord. So, it could have been worse. Yes, indeed. Oof. The 20. I did get the health back, though. That's good. Ooh. Ooh.
There we go. We got that one. We we finished all the ones that require a specific condition. So now we just need to just do races. Mm. We do a rest. So yeah, we're pretty good for everything now. We should be able to get through it and win everything, providing we are not careless with our free calls. Our free calls are literally what make or break this uh, scenario, so do your best to make sure, even if it may not seem beneficial, to be sure you actually... Fifty-two. Oh. Oh. We're going blue, baby. Over a hundred guts. Yeah. Ideal. We just got the regular carrot. Well, it's better than getting the tissue and losing mood. We just need red. We need that. I guess we go for the biggest. We go for the biggest win. Oh. We're looking good now. We're looking good. Holy moly. Holy moly! <laughs> I don't think we're getting too lucky right now with the particulars. Right, I changed this to red. And then we're done. Uh-oh. I'm gonna get pelted. I don't wanna get pelted. Has Hasberry. <laughs> don't 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 throw it at me, okay? Leader. Hold your tail high, a nice cheap one. There you go. Steady advance. Rising passion. <gasps> it's love! Thank you! Mwah. Thank you, Hasberry. Alright, it's another G2. Skip! Are you gonna get it? <laughs> Are you gonna be able to throw the snowball? Where's it gonna go? Where's the snowball? Where is it gonna go? Is it gonna hit me? Is it gonna hit the game? Is it gonna hit chat? <laughs> Who knows? Because <gasps> I don't.
pretty decent. Not the best inheritance, but not the worst either. Whoa. <gasps> She's gonna leave me in suspense, aren't you? <laughs> She's gonna leave me in suspense, and I'm just gonna be that, like, just worried. Just like, no, don't, don't hit me. <laughs> don't hit me. I'm innocent. I shall be living in constant fear until that ball is thrown. <laughs> Unless you know the stream ends before that. <laughs> you can throw it at me, but I'm not going to be able to interact with it like the snowball redeeming tits. So, you know, bear that in mind. When you decide to throw it. Da ba 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 <laughs> it's a nifty little add-on, I have to say. Yeah, people have to set it up, but if you do, you can do all sorts. You can throw all sorts of things. I'm glad you like it. It was worth setting it up. Hmm. Will Shovel Grand actually be better than the previous Shovel Grand I have raised? I am not sure. I mean, realizing that her signature skill is medium distance makes me think, even though she's, it says she's long distance, maybe medium is more her thing? Maybe? Uh, what? Refresh the page. I did change it. What the heck? Why is it come back to Power World? <laughs> I don't know why it did that. I, I did done. I don't get it. <laughs> Oh, then, did you know there's a bot? Well, it might be a bot soliciting art from Hazzy. That might be what it is. That might be why you were summoned. <laughs> Of course you do. <laughs> so long as it's been dealt with, I'm satisfied. Okay, thank you then. Thank you. I do hope you're looking forward to Mario Kart tomorrow. We have at least five people, so that's good. I am very much looking forward to it. When the girl in first place uses a skill called passing preparations. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry to hear that. It would have been cool if we if you could have joined us. An absolute domination by Shevel Grand. Her legacy continues. Damn straight.
Oh my goodness, more bad news? Really? What's the matter? What on earth could more bad news be? It was kind of funny. <laughs> I got a notification. Oh, is it? What what happened? That seemed that, I thought that was going okay. Granted, I hadn't watched anything after season 5 of Ruby, but I didn't realize anything had gone bad. I mean, I know Red vs. Blue's reboot didn't go great, from what I'm understanding. Huh. Well, that is most certainly an unfortunate turn of events. Ooh. Let's see what we get from this. Like I said, we were well set up for this. So I'm quite satisfied with how this is going. Halfway to a dream. If you're not in the back of the pack, your speed and acceleration will increase. Scales with the number of fans. She should have a decent amount of fans. Let's buy some skills. I mean, I guess that's just how the cr cookie crumbles. I'm not looking so hot in regards to Shevel Grand getting... Getting to be better than the previously raised Shevel Grand I've managed to raise. <sighs> stretchy, stretchy. <laughs> I mean, so long as Red vs. Blue is the OG series is still on YouTube, then it's fine. Unless they're going to close down the YouTube channel. In which case, that would definitely be a big blow to me. If Red vs. Blue is still on Netflix, that would be cool. I mean, you know. With everything that's happened to Rooster Teeth, I'm I'm sure I'm hoping that you know some of their IPs can still survive afterwards. So yes, after this, after this scenario, we're going to look at, um, Shevel Grand's story. I say this despite not knowing if we're actually going to be able to unlock the final part of her story or not. One thing I do know is that, you know, some of the stories in one of my patches have been translated, and Shevel Grants is one of them. What? Me? Me run? <laughs> I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it for you, Murray. I'll win. I'll win for you. Oh, I'm tired. <laughs> oh, I'm tired. Sorry. I did my best. <laughs> How are you doing, Murray? I do hope you're having a swell day. It'd be nice if some people were.
Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Appreciate it. Well, even if I failed to win the race, Shevel Grand will definitely do it. I'm having a pretty good day. I mean, I actually didn't feel tired for once, so the stream actually did happen. So that's good. So, yes, we are, uh, we're approaching the second beach episode. And with that is our last real chance to really hammer home our, uh, our ability to become a great horse girl. Unlimited lifting is maxed out. I actually didn't realize that. So just one more Umamusume Athletics Festival and then hopefully, fingers crossed, we will get the maximum end of scenario buff. Eighty five. Oh. 77. I think we've got to go for the bigger one and the potential energy recovery. No energy recovery. Uh, yellow. And with that, we can finish off that training too. 69. 70. 65. For the potential energy recovery again. Come on, give us some energy back. It's the beach episode. <laughs> it's the beach episode, of course. Ooh. Mm. I've had better beach episodes. But at least... We will have achieved... The minimal requirements to max out our end of run stat buff. <clears throat> so that's really all that's important. Ooh. It is kind of unfortunate, though. <laughs> there have been many aspects of this run that have been good, but there are some who have not been optimal, shall we say. We're going all in. 100 guts! <gasps> nice. Head pads! Thank you, Miri! <gasps> Any more stats? Prepare to die! <laughs> Prepare to die! Wah ha ha! Also, it's funny, I had a throne link set up on my About Me page on Twitch, but I I didn't actually link my wishlist. I linked whoever clicked on its wishlist. Ah, oh, Murray, you caught me! Congrats! <laughs> I can't believe you did it. How amazing. Good for you. Emil, Emil. If I were a Pokemon, right? Uh, 
Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh. <laughs> I love how the head pats and then throw water and energy drinks at him. Hydrate. <laughs> Hey, you should be happy, Junebug. Your head bunk emote will be commissioned tonight. Along with five other emotes. Hopefully, in time for the subathon in a few weeks. Fingers crossed. <laughs> oh dear, that's adulthood for you. That's just growing up, unfortunately. So yes, the emotes that are gonna be commissioned are... Head bunk, raid, cheering, vibe, like, like, you know, bunk, you know, the vibe cat sort of thing, wiggle, and one other one. <laughs> That doesn't come to mind right now, unfortunately. Ah. Hug. I suppose I could have hug. We'll see. We'll, we'll, we'll see what the final one is. It could also be drink. I do most certainly do post the occasional hug offer. But yeah, the best thing about these new emotes is they're all going to be animated. Some of them will have to be on better TTV. Ah, <laughs> oh, drunk Emil, I don't know about that. When I get drunk, it's more I feel tired and lethargic and dizzy. Are there any specifics to the head bonk emote you want me to commission, Junebug? Do you want it to be like, it hits me and then like, birds fly around me or dizzy eyes or something maybe? I mean, you're going to be the one using it most, even if it is, like, going to be a sub-only thing. <laughs> yes, I will probably post another hug to everyone tonight as well. All right, we had no bad rest. More energy. Holy moly. That was the wrong one. I didn't mean to do that. Whoops. There is a head pat in the current sub animated emotes. We're gonna go for it. We're gonna go. We're gonna make this... This shovel grand the medium distance. See how that goes. When the new emotes are made, I'll probably make that one one of the free ones. Don't worry. I mean, you also have the actual head pat one as well. So that's something at least, right? <laughs> I mean, if you want to do that, that would be, that would be very good. I would be very happy. <laughs> I mean, you could very well be gifted a sub if, uh, 
if things go well. Oh, wait a second. Oh, right. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot to connect all these emotes being posted in chat and they're not dropping on my head because I forgot to activate them. There we go. There we go. There'll be some at the end at least. I will just say this for you, Murray. Hug. There you go. <laughs> My model can't move very much to offer a hug or anything. But maybe one day I will update this uh, rigging so I can like offer hugs and stuff. The model itself is amazing. I love it. But I do see some people with rigs where they can actually change their body position and stuff. It would be cool if my model could do that one day. I do have an SSD and RAM to pay off, but after that, that should I should have a little bit of extra money to to save up for a rig, a more advanced one maybe. But the 3D model comes first, of course. I do think I'm gonna have enough time to do Chevel Grand Story. It'll be story time with Emil Hart. The story of Anuma Musume who feels inferior to her sisters, but also wants to be in the similar league to them, if not the same. It's gonna be a very wholesome one. I mean, let me put it this way, 300 followers isn't really, isn't really gonna make money, is it? Let's be fair here, let's be real. So obviously I do have a full-time job. Hence why my stream schedule's all over the place week by week. Let me fade, let me give you this way. If I was making a living off VTubing, I would definitely have a more consistent schedule. Absolutely. Yeah. Small streamers like myself, we generally all have full-time jobs. <sighs> or, you know, any job, really. Economy's tough. No matter where you live, I don't think. Oh, I love it when it gives me 10 free gems from a race. <laughs> Thank you, game. Very generous of you. Oh, I think you'd have to at least be partner. I imagine at least uh, 500 re regular viewers, maybe even a thousand. Even that might not be that much. Yes, we got guts. We got guts. Right, we're definitely having a rest. There we go. So our URA finals run should be good. Oh yeah, we barely did push the rock. We barely had enough to push the rock. But the important thing is, we did it. We're gonna get the maximum benefit now. 
We're gonna get the maximum stat increase for our stats. We'll skip the concert because I don't really want to have all that trouble of like changing the aspect ratio. Hmm. I'll change it to blue. Blue seems to be a good one. <laughs> or so I thought. Apparently it's not actually as good. Hmm. I'm not... Seeing this is gonna be too good. I mean, it doesn't help that she's stamina focused. And stamina isn't that high. So that's unfortunate, but... Alright, I need to quickly use the bathroom. I'll be back in a sec, guys. I will not turn the uh, the race off though. Don't worry. You can still watch that. どうより下雲が空を覆う中山レース場。この空を映したように芝は山山の発表となりました。阿部が本格化したら難しいレースになってしまいそうですね。人気と実力を兼ね備えたスペシャルウィーク。今日は3番人気です。2番人気を紹介しましょう。ジャングルパケット。スタンドに押しかけたファンの期待を一身に背負って、ここまで無敗。グランプリ馬娘、シュバルグラン。1番人気です。気合十分。いい顔してますね。ゲート員完了。出走
if only I could have a more consistent stream schedule so you could catch me more often, I would, uh, I would love to be able to do that. <laughs> but thank you, you've really made my night, you know? Oh man, I can't wait to see <laughs> how her final stats end up. This is what we hope for. This is what I'm working towards. I mean, I've been working hard to make my streams more appealing to people. But I think there's only so much you can do in regards to, like, offering things for the viewers to do and stuff. I mean, to be fair, you know. It's easy to compare yourself to bigger VTubers and think, I wish I had half of what you have. It's nice when those people actually appreciate what they, uh, what they have. I am also so glad I've actually managed to figure out some of the uh, issues with my model. You see that? My eyes actually move again. It's, it's good, you know. And being a bit more bouncy. I do like that. Oh yes, I am looking forward to that as well. <gasps> Junebug was talking about it earlier, actually. About how he was excited that it was finally going to come to PC. <laughs> it's nice when a game people are like, actually get to a, to a wider audience. I know there are the console wars and all that. The fact that that still happens. <laughs> yes, the console wars are stupid. <laughs> oh man, Neo Universe. I want to pull her at some point. You know how competitive people are. Everyone was like, PlayStation has no exclusives herder, and then the, the, they start coming to PC, the ones they do have. And now that there's like a couple of PlayStation, uh, Xbox games coming to PlayStation, they're throwing that shade back at them. Wow. <laughs> Whoa, Shevel Grand, your lead is massive. <laughs> I feel like that's partially why people are like going to other places. I want everyone to meet. I want everyone who sees my my tweets like that. I want them to know that there is someone out there. Who will give them a comforting hug if they need it. Being a comfy streamer is also important. I know most of the big VTubers are like chaotic and like gremlins <laughs> like sometimes. And that's fine. I just don't I just can't do that. I I just can't. I just decide I just decided as soon as being a VTuber, it's like I'm gonna I'm just gonna stay how I was as a regular streamer. Just you know. Just chill, casual, comfy. That's all I want to be. Even if I don't get the sort of recognition that the biggest VTubers get. That was never really at the forefront of my mind, you know, when I when it came to being a VTuber. I was like, I know I'm not going to be big. I know that I don't quite have the personality to do that. So, the fact that I've achieved as much as I have... It's all that I care about. I'm just happy to... I'm just happy to be where I am now. 
yes, you can look at your friends and seeing them get big, and then it's just like, you should always try and be happy. You should just be happy with what you have, because, you know, <laughs> there's always going to be people who, you know, wish they had what you have, even if you're not that big. And I think, you know, everyone needs to appreciate what they are and what they, they, they can achieve. If you come into VTubing just because you want to be, like, massive, even though, you know, you probably, you probably won't. It's a huge market. There's loads and loads and loads of VTubers. You have to put a lot of time and effort into being a VTuber to even get close to being able to be successful. So, you get... You generally get what you... Get out of it what you put in. There is an element of luck as well. That's absolutely true. And when you do get lucky, you've got to hope you do something that makes people want to come back for more, you know? I mean, I'm waiting for Fan Fantasy Rebirth to come out on PC before I get it. I don't want to sink 500 pounds into a PS4, or a PS5 even, that I'm only going to use for like a handful of games. I've spent so much on making my PC as good as it is. I'm gonna... I'm gonna do most of my gaming on the PC. I know. <laughs> oh yeah, absolutely. Especially when there was like shortages of the console. <laughs> Going to a local like exchange store, seeing PS5s when it was sh in a shortage, being sold for like 850 pounds when it was like 430. Crazy. <laughs> I was a huge Final Fantasy fan round about when I got my PlayStation, my original PlayStation, the PS1 version, and I got Final Fantasy IX. That was my first dip into it, and I've played most of them since. I do really love Final Fantasy. Not so much more recent entries. I am a- I am an old man. <laughs> I'm not a grandpa. Don't call me a grandpa. Come on. <laughs> yes, I'm older than most VTubers, but I'm not a grandpa. I guess you got- guess technically, VTuber-wise, you could call me a grandpa. Uh, <laughs> 35 <clears throat> this year. Oof. <laughs> there is certainly an element, you know. <laughs> you notice the, the a lot of the big VTubers are like in their early mid twenties. Well, I'm glad you're saying that, not, you know, I don't want to, I, I don't want to be a grandpa. Uh, it's fine, though. <laughs> Maybe those are just the ones you like, Junebug. <laughs> you notice a lot of the big agency VTubers are, like, in their 20s. Fair enough. There we go. This is the what I was working towards. Unfortunately, a lot of my stats are like... Really high. I tend to find that the biggest and best umas 
will literally have every stat at, at least UG rank, which is 1,200 points each. Right, 160. I'll get that 161. And there you go. Just have one left over. That'd probably work. I'll bet you do, Junebug. <laughs> Grand Expedition and full power pitch. Whoops. Forgot to trigger that. Oh, wait. I can't do it because... Oh, oh no. <gasps> because I chose full power pitch. I can't evolve heart and soul. Whoops. Ah, <sighs> that's not better than what I did her before. I think I have to re-roll at least. <laughs> it's gonna be my only run today, so I'm gonna have to... Yep. I did have medium, though. A three-star medium? I'll take it. Tenacious spirit. There you go. My shovel grand is tenacious, if nothing else. Yeah. Hmm. If I had max limit broken support cards, then I probably would have much better stats overall. I did not unlock her final story. Darn it. Damn, I was so close. Well... I kind of feel like I shouldn't do her story until I unlock it all. Because I don't want to leave people on a cliffhanger for the final part, you know? So, I think we'll end the stream here. So, let me thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day. I will be raiding, so if you want to get passed on to another VTuber, then feel free. I should probably do a redeem where it's like, suggest a raid, someone to raid, and then, you know, make it really expensive. Just so, you know, people have things to spend points on, because I do think I need more redeems. I will be working on that, hopefully, over this year. You will get some more before the end of it. I guarantee you that. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow for Marco and the Galaxy Dragon and Mario Kart 8 Deluxe collab with at least five other VTubers. So, I hope you look forward to that. I don't know if Junebug would want to join us because he didn't say anything. And he did say he didn't really feel like it because of the bad news he's had today. Which is fine. I hope you'll at least come and support me. It would be nice. <laughs> so, with that said, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care and have a great night, everybody. And Junebug, you try to. <laughs> it might be a bit much to ask you to try, but I hope you do try. <gasps> okay, see you later. Bye!